Hi, this is the beginner waltz lesson that we taught at 7.30 on January 9th. We're happy you came, or if you didn't come, glad you're watching. Here's what we taught. One, two, three, two. Phrases of eight, and that's why we did eight for you. Okay. The rhythm of waltz, we said, was kind of like marching. Some of you helped, that helped you understand what it was. Others, you could say, it's just like walking. It's a very, very rhythmic, evenly rhythmic uh, tempo. It's one, two, three, and then we count two, two, three, three, two, three, all the way up to eight. So that wasn't tricky at all. We talked to you about the closed dance position where Don's right hand is on my left shoulder blade, my left hand is on top of his arm, not behind his neck, for safety's sake. Gentlemen, your left hand is shoulder level with your partner. And our feet are offset so that my right foot would go between his two feet and his right foot would go between my two feet. That's so that we don't have to dance like this. Right? So dancing towards you, we did a one, two, three. On the two, we took Tell me you took your left hand and you brought it in between you as you ended up in a sweetheart or a cuddle position. Two, two, three. So we oh. then go ahead. We then danced two basics. As you notice, in the cuddle position or the sweetheart position, I am slightly ahead of him, kind of snuggled into his right arm, not just because it's comfortable, but because it helps him to have contact with me so that he knows where I am and I know where he is. On count three, two, three, we're dancing with our outside feet moving first, my right foot, Don's left foot. Three, two, three, and on count four, two, three, inside feet. Four, two, three. We're turning around to the end facing. This is where we unwind around the five, so we're both stepping forward and releasing. Five, two, and then we're so my role as a follower, among other things, because he's not going to tell me what he's doing, is to keep my hand and my shoulder aligned, whether it's my left hand that's in his right or my right hand that's in his left. With edge, whichever hand is connected, I try to keep in front of my shoulder. So right now, my left hand is actually not in front of my shoulder. As we step five, we, as Don said, we both step together. I'm on my I'm, left. On count, count two, he's starting to unwind me. Here's the two. And then on three, he steps sideways. So as you can see now, we're exactly where I need to be. My left shoulder and my left hand are aligned. So that was five, two, three. On six, gentlemen, I said we were going to see. We're going to be doing a grapevine. So we step forward on count six. How did I know to step forward? Don moved my hand. Remember, I said I have to follow my hand. So now they're still aligned. There's a six. On count two, he says, please go sideways again. Notice my hand is still aligned with the shoulder. And on count three, we hook behind. That makes it a great line. Six, two, uh, three. Here comes seven, two, three. Go ahead. Seven, two, three. So now we're in another sweetheart, but this time it's on her shoulder versus around so her waist. So we call this a headlock. So from this direction, we're going to unwrap. We're going we're gonna to unwrap. Three. I'm sorry. Five, two, three. Six, two, three, seven, two, three, and here's our famous Kmart out. Don releases, the right hand is on my shoulder, moves it to my shoulder blade, does his footwork in place, and creates a great big swoop with his right hand, left hand. Eight, two, three. From this direction, we're going to be stepping forward on eight, is that right? Yes, eight, which is our inside feet. Eight, and his hand is moving to my shoulder blade, you may be able to see that as I turn, his hand will slide from my right shoulder blade to my left shoulder blade. Two, three. And gentlemen, on a two, three, we're just doing our feet together. Now we'll do a regular one. One, two, three. So maybe from this direction, and then we'll call it a day. So we have one, two, three, two,
great, so were you. We certainly enjoyed having you in the class. Please join us again this weekend. We'll be doing that club. That club. In the meantime, happy dancing.